Here I am out there in Bournemouth at an Adam Murray event with Steve Collins and Nigel Benn, two men that have fought each other. Nigel Benn is one of my favourite fighters of all time. Steve Collins is a very good friend, actually boxed Steve twice. It's always an honour to be in both their companies. Here, here I am, my friend Nigel Benn, one of the greatest fighters ever to grace a boxer. He's actually one of my favourite fighters. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. Very well, Nigel. Yeah, good, mate. Good to see you. It's great to see you too. Anyway, about, you? Everything's well. It's my friend Liam Galvin, Nigel. Hey, there, Liam. How are you, mate? Yeah. What's your favourite Nigel Ben fight, Joe? I know it's a tragic fight, but the Gerald McKellen fight was actually uh, probably my favourite fight. I know it's I know it's a sore subject, but it was it was a fantastic fight. You know, we, you know, it, it, it was a fantastic fight. And it, all, everything, and everything. So Joe, uh, Michael, Joe's retired. Any advice for him in retirement? Just enjoy his life now. That's what it's all about. It's about enjoying life. You put his shoes in, put the hours in, put the work in. That's all about enjoying your life, and that's what he's got to do now. That's what we're doing, enjoying our life. We are enjoying our lives. We've got good lives now. That's We've got right, good that's lives, and it's lovely to meet up with Nigel. Right, good man, Nigel. Well, thank you. This is my friend, Kevin the Look Lushing. Former British champion and world title contender. Over the world title, probably against one of the greatest fighters of that era, Felix Trinidad. Oh, Felix Trinidad yeah, without a shadow of a doubt. You know, had and Kevin floor. had him on the deck. Oh, he had him down. Kevin could punch. But reality come back and No, 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 it's boxing. That's what makes boxing so great because it is unpredictable. You don't know. Everybody, Kevin was in there with a puncher's chance. Same as Trinidad was in there with a puncher's chance. But he had the experience. A lot more experience than you. Exactly. You know, a lot more experience than you. But you've done yourself well. I did. Kevin is now manager to the different boxers. He puts them on the circuit, gets them to dinner events. You know, but in his own right, Kevin is a boxing star himself. You know, so in his own. Joey, he's been on the circuit for a long time. He gets a lot of people, a lot of people like um, Joey, he has a lot of time for people, and that makes a difference when you become a people's champion. And that's why Nigel, Steve, and other boxers have got time for Joey. Always one of the guys. When you come to any of these events to meet the great champions, there's always an opportunity to get photographs taken, which is the most important part of the night, because a, a photograph you can keep forever. great opportunity now for me to get my picture took between the two great champions Steve Collins and Nigel Ben and an opportunity to have a little chat with Nigel. I love talking to Nigel because he is one of my favourite fighters of all time. I'm not talking boxing now, we're actually talking music because Nigel knows his music. We're finished now doing the photographs, we're just getting ready to go to the event itself. Adam Murray has put on a fantastic show in Bournemouth. Adam does some fantastic work for the Murray Foundation, which is his own charity organisation. He's an amazing man, Adam Murray. You know the, the, the race? You know we're going to do the racing. So we're just going out now to the limos, on our way to the hotel where the event is going to be held. What a character Nigel Ben is. Right, I'll see you up at the hotel. Alright mate, see you up at the hotel. Alright buddy, see you later on mate. And you too. Hey, Steve. See you up at the hotel. Steve's just gonna join us. 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 Steve's just when we arrive at the hotel in Bournemouth, this young 15 or 16 year old boy leans into the car to get his picture took with Nigel Ben and Steve Collins. They were giving me stick, saying anybody could get past me to get to them. It was only a young lad that wanted his picture took. I didn't want to stop him having his picture took. So I was posing for the photographs as well. Had you got, had you got the video running when that happened? Had you? You know, was it well protected, Steve? I did until that guy leaned in the car and called Joe a, 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 a bad name and called Nigel a bad name. And uh, Joe, Joe, Joe was distracted because there was a camera there. Joe was looking at the camera and I wasn't paying attention to it. Uh, he, 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 didn't, he didn't call me any names, so I don't worry. Did you feel well protected by Joe in there? 
No. Yeah. <laughs> listen, just kidding, guys. No, don't listen to the word he said. I was watching the camera, yeah, 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 yeah. They can do more damage yeah, with them camera yeah, lenses, yeah, yeah. right? Richard, no, I'm joking, joking. Listen, listen, he's taking it to heart. Let me uh, reel him in. He's biting. Like, I, I was watching the cameraman. They do more damage. <laughs>